Sunshine FM, Big D here right through until 10 o'clock tonight. I hope you can stick around. Well, Tracy's been at it again, discovering great new music and giving us the opportunity to uh, to catch up with these artists and find out a little bit about them. The latest one we're going to be talking to is El Cosgrove. The new EP is called Guitars and Cigars and the single is called The Unfamiliar and I'm pleased to say that El joins me now. Uh, congratulations on the new single and the EP, El. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Oh, it's an absolute pleasure. You have got a beautiful voice, very unique. Oh, thank you. <laughs> when did you discover that you could sing? I don't think I used to be a very good singer at all. <laughs> but um, music's just, yeah, kind of been a part of growing up and had a really musical family. So it's just something that, yeah, I've loved and I guess I've developed my own style a little bit. You mentioned a musical family. What sort of music influences did you have? Probably not country <laughs> but um my family were probably more into jazz and big bands and a little bit folky yeah i did have one cousin from Curtin that used to come and play some country songs on our veranda when i was little yeah that's probably more of the country influence and then i guess i just started writing songs about growing up on a farm and you know when you're a little kid doing country sort of stuff it it comes out sounding pretty country in your song, so yeah, just developed from there, I suppose. Now, you mentioned growing up on a farm. Whereabouts uh, does El Cosgrove call home? I grew up just outside of Dolby. Yeah, I'm living out near Taroom now. Still out in the country a little bit. One of the things I imagine living in the country is that the eclectic sound that you probably have developed over the years with your music is readily accepted. It just depends on different people I suppose but I do love playing country towns and I love traveling around and, and definitely playing even smaller towns out west. probably like that even more than you know playing in the city I don't really go in you know Brisbane or you know, too much I like touring around because I feel like yeah probably country people appreciate it and it's always a good time. You mentioned gigging around the place what sort of gigs have you got upcoming? I had a really great release party down in Dolby and then I headed down to the Tamworth Country Music Festival so I released my EP down there which was a great time and uh, yeah since then I've just been I've been pretty much organising some upcoming gigs so they're going to be announced on my website soon but yeah definitely around Western Queensland and um, possibly a few in New South Wales as well but yeah, they'll be on my website and my social media. First stop this weekend, actually, out at Byfield at the Rainforest Ranch. Lee McAllister and Liam Brew are playing out there, so I'll be doing a bit of a support act, and um, there's a few other great local artists playing. So, yeah, that's definitely one to look forward to. Elle, it's been great to catch up with you tonight. If people want to find out a little bit more about you, you mentioned you've got a website. What's the address? lcosgrove.com, Facebook, Instagram, all that kind of stuff. Well, folks, you're going to love the sound. The song's called Unfamiliar. The EP's called Guitars and Cigars. I'm going to play a bit of Al Cosgrove now. Look forward to catching up with you soon and enjoy Byfield this weekend. Thank you. It's been good chat. Cold coffee, no.